The lack of electricity is no doubt a key factor in Nigeria's social and economic underdevelopment. Owing to the increasing dependence by the manufacturing industry, organizations and households, some Nigerians are taking development into their own hands, sourcing for an alternative power supply in addition to the hydropower generation in the country. Somewhere in Vom, just south local government area of Plateau State, one man has been exploring an alternative means of electricity generation through solar system after he encountered untold hardship and near bankruptcy in his businesses owing to irregular power supply. How can you work if there's no light? We want to see the farms, for example, where there's beaming of light, where production of food will be done day and night. People will be doing work of farming, shifting. Some will do in the afternoon, some will do in the night. The solar energy garden has everything required for electricity generation, ranging from solar panels, cables, as well as transformers that were manufactured and coupled within the premises. We had to do a lot of research. In the first place, we had to go to all the 774 local governments in Nigeria to get the solar readings, the solar yield in six randomly selected local I mean, areas in each of the local governments. This is in view of the fact that one, we, once we want to start generation in any part of Nigeria, we will have very little survey to do now because we have all the data. In spite of the numerous challenges, the company is receiving encouragement and patronage as the Plateau State government and individuals have shown interest in solar power supply. We want to train Nigerians. We would not like to just have this technology to ourselves. One day we would want to have a, a laboratory, we have to have a factory where we do these things, where thousands of Nigerians can come. But we need, we need that support. We cannot go for loan for such kind of thing. In developed countries and in all the places that it would have been grants. At the Plateau State Ministry of Water Resources and Energy, all electrical appliances are now powered by solar energy. The state government is also looking to consolidate solar energy as an alternative source, considering the current exorbitant rate of electricity. The government of Plateau State is key into the global initiative towards combating climate change. Climate change is as a result of um, different things. One of them is the use of what we call fossil fuel. That increases the amount of CO2 in the atmosphere, creating a kind of envelope around the earth and causing overheating of the earth. As the federal government focuses on the economic recovery and growth plan, the place of power generation, especially alternative power generation, many believe needs to be explored by encouraging individuals and investing in the people towards building a globally competitive economy. Oh, gosh.